Hello, I'm Mandeep Singh, founder of Mandeeps.com. In this video, we will be installing our live content module. So let's begin. To install the module, you have to log in as a super user or as a host account. Live content module installation is the same as any other standard DNN module installation. We'll begin by going to the host menu, module definitions, module definitions we'll choose to install module we'll browse for our module file now the zip file we've downloaded from either mandeeps.com or snowwordcover.com that has the live content module needs to be extracted or unzipped once we unzip it we will have two folders documentation and install files so we'll look into the install files and we're looking for the live content 3 point hole dnn5 install file so once we have our info install file we'll go ahead and select that continue continue on again you have to select the license agreement which we'll do down here so we'll click next at this point the module is being installed we just need to confirm that there was no error so we scroll down to the very bottom and we just make sure it says installation successful that's it, live content is installed. Now, because live content is a very powerful module and has so many other features, we have a built in system check to make sure that your hosting environment is set up to work with live content module. Let's go ahead and add live content module to the page. And the first thing you notice when you uh, insert live content module to a page is it asks you to confirm which edition of the module would you like to use. Now if you're not sure which edition you would want to use, go ahead and click on help me choose link and that'll do give you an edition comparison which one works out. If you've already purchased the module then select the edition that you've purchased. In our case we'll just use standard edition and we'll just continue with the trial. Okay. So the very first thing we want to do after we install the module is do a system check and that's like one time thing so you want to make sure that live content functionality uh, is available within this hosting environment. So let's go ahead and click on system check. Now the system check is telling us the trust level the site is running at which is unrestricted unrestricted which is the same as full trust which is a good thing because live content has so many different functions and features that it requires full trust for you to be able to use them all together. It's also showing right here that MP4 DNN extension and F FLV DNN extensions were found. Also showing that video encoding test was successful. What we're seeing in error is that there's no MP4 MIME type set up on the web server. Now this is something you would simply ask your hosting a company to do for you. you. Just send them an email or call them and say, can you please add MP4 MIME type and they will do that for you. Now if you're hosting the site on your own web server, you'd have to do this at IS yourself. So we'll go ahead and do that really quick just to show how it will look once it's done. Simply just add a MP4 MIME type. Once you add the MP4 MIME type, and we run the system check again you should see all green errors and everything should be good to go all right now notice by default this mp4 and flv dnn extensions are not already there so if you're not seeing these green errors it's very easy to add them you just go to host host settings scroll down to other settings and here's allowable file extensions. Notice we have FLV and MP4 added. So if I go ahead and just take this away for demonstration purposes, hit update, go back to our live content page, to a system check, we'll see that they're not added. So when you if you see this, just go ahead, go back to host settings, go to other settings, and right here just add FLV and MP4 and that's it we're done with live content installation now there's one more thing I would like to point out if you're running uh, your site in medium trust 
or on a hosting provider hosting company that does not give you full trust such as GoDaddy then you would not see uh, unrestricted as your trust level what you would see instead would be medium trust level in this case the video encoding feature of live content module will not work in addition to all these other features which will not work in medium trust additionally live content module cannot automatically check for you if the MIME types are set up correctly so in that case you would have to check with your hosting provider if they're set up correctly or you can test it yourself the way you test it is simply click on these links if a video starts playing then the MIME type is set up correctly if a video doesn't start playing you're prompted with a download option that's fine too that means MIME type is set up correctly but if you get a page not found or a 403 or a 404 error that means the MIME type is not set up correctly so simply contact your hosting company and they will take care of it for you so back to our our install uh, we're done at this point and we're ready to go now we'll also we'll also cover how to activate your module since we're here so activating your module is fairly easy you can click on activate license and here's ask you to confirm the edition you would like to activate you can also get to the screen from mandeeps.com license manager as well so we would like to go ahead and activate standard edition so we'll say activate module like I said if you've already purchased a license you can go to step 2 Otherwise, click on purchase license which will redirect you to our site where you can buy the module so we'll go ahead and click request activation key simply type in your email address here that you use to purchase the module if you purchase the module from our site this will be your PayPal address if you purchase the module through snow covered this will be your snow covered email address once you do that hit submit and your activation key will be emailed to you instantaneously once you have your activation key simply click on apply activation key and paste your activation key in there and that's it it'll say your module has been successfully activated and you're all set to go that was it for live content installation video be sure to check out other videos for live content functions and features if you have any questions concerns please go ahead and do contact us thank you for watching the video